Thank you. Oh. Hi. I'm, my name is Marge Brodall, and um, I work for Toolbox Creative, and I'm a foxaholic. So what that means is um, what the four college foxes are, it is a um, college athletes travel all over the country to play in summer wood bat league baseball. And um, we've got a team here at Fort Collins, since they're called the Fort Collins Foxes. And uh, they play at City Park every summer, June and July in uh, every summer. And uh, so these are just some of the pictures. So let me go through some of the, um, some of the boys that we've had at our house. Adam was our first young man that uh, came to live with us in 2005. And it's all about eating when the boys live with us. So we teach them how to cook. None of them rarely know how to cook. Um, and, and here's Tim. Tim came in 06. And a couple of these pictures are him um, cooking and uh, making a cake. And we take him to Rockies games. And there, you know, a bunch of his buddies are there at the Rockies games. Um, and here's more of Tim cooking and hanging out in the backyard. We have parties in the backyard. We play games. A bunch of his buds come over and uh, hang out, you know, so our house is just kind of a boy central in the summer. Um, it's a lot of fun. Um, and then there's Tony. Tony's going to stand up. This is Tony. <laughs> Tony is awesome. He's, he's the most uninhibited kid that I've ever met. He's a blast to have. We just, we just love him to death. I mean, you can tell that, you know, he's, he, he smokes cigars, and he eats, and he plays golf, and, you know, he's got a great ass, and, you know, that upper. <laughs> so Tony's a, Tony's a lot of fun. And here's just more of Tony cooking and hanging out and doing beer shots. And, and we went up to Red Rocks one time, and you know, went to a concert, and he's writing his list of on the bottom thing, he's like, get tampons or something like that. And then, and then the next year, Adam returned as, a, as a, a, an assistant coach and lived with us again for the summer. And he met Bob Bacon. And you know he's playing an accordion that all of our kids have to do, because my husband is a former accordion champ. Um, and so in 09, we had Jared and Mikey. They're from Texas. And uh, they went to, to the same school as Adam. So that was a, a connection right there. You know, Jared got the Fox's logo engraved in his head and, and you know, doing, and here's just more. It's all about eating. There's Mikey eating and took him up to uh, Estes Park and the Stanley. They couldn't believe they were at the Stanley, you know, where they filmed Dumb and Dumber. They were just beside themselves over that. <laughs> the whole, they had to sit in the bar where the Dumb and Dumber people. And then last year we had Eric, and um, biggest Oregon State fan on the planet. He doesn't go to Oregon State, but... Um, he's from Oregon State. His dad is a, is a baseball coach there, and uh, I took him to glass. I'm a fused glass artist, and I uh, took Eric. Here's more of Eric. Took him to CU. They wanted to see the stadium, and, and uh, we went to the aquarium. That was a great day in Denver that, that I took uh, some of the kids down to Denver for the day and spent some time down there. They're just a great group of guys that, that come every year. Now, Michael, Michael didn't live with us, but he came back. After he graduated um, from school, he got an education degree. He fell in love with Fort Collins. He's from Michigan. He came back, and he's now teaching elementary school in Severance. But he lived with us. When he came back, he, he lived with us. So it's like, where are they now? So Adam is uh, studying for the bar. He graduated from law school, and he's studying for the bar. And Tim on the bottom, he's married. He's a dad now. You can see his gorgeous little boy. Michael is married. He has a little boy, too. They live in Severance. Um, Tony came back. These are pictures of Tony. Um, took him to glass. He is a gifted fused glass artist. Who would have thought that this nut job kid, this <laughs> knucklehead, was, uh, was such a great, great fused glass artist? Uh, Jared and Mikey are still uh, in school. They're seniors at uh, University of Texas San Antonio, and Eric is a senior uh, at Linfield, where Scott Brocious, former Yankees MVP, uh, is his coach. And our future boys of the summer are coming this year, Matt and Trey. I've only met them via email and Facebook, but these are our kids coming up this summer. And um, as you can tell, I'm one of those ladies that I look like this. Everybody knows these ladies, you know, with the with all the gear and all the stuff. But the bottom line here is the lasting friendships that we get as being a host family. We've made great friends with other host families. The guys make great friends, and they stay uh, in touch and, uh, and do all of that. So 
it, if anybody is interested in being a host family, it's a blast. And we're always looking for new host families for these players that come in. It's June and July every year. Um, you can just go to the fourcollinsfoxes.com. And um, Sean, back to you. <laughs> All right.